Here comes the pride fighter. And a woman who is all about the power. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Shamam, New Jersey. Sonya Deville! Throughout her career, Sonya has shown her adaptability as a tag team competitor, a single star, and even a backstage official. You absolutely cannot trust Sonya, but you can depend on the fact that she will do anything to reach the top of WWE. And guys, I hope Santa was good to you this morning. Oh, he's always good to me, Cole. Though I'm pretty sure Saxton ended up with Cole in his stocking. Perhaps the best female high flyer in WWE, Io Sky. And you can never discount the backup, the control on the ground every time Io is around. And representing damage control from Tokyo, Japan, Io Sky. Io Sky's list of titles in Japan is a mile long across every major women's division. Yeah, here in WWE, Io has continued that success, but she has something now she didn't have then. She has control. Io Sky made her mark in NXT history as one of the most accomplished superstars in the brand's entire history. Yeah, but Io's change in attitude and her new allies ensure even more success in WWE. The genius of the sky, poised and ready for action here tonight. There are superstars, and then there are superstars. And guess which category EO fits into? Larger than life, unafraid of just going forward in the ring, Sky is everything you could possibly want in a competitor. Sky has really redefined what it means to be a high flyer in WWE, and she's looking ready to do it again tonight. Facing off against Sonya Deville. What I really like about Sonya is that she's never once changed her tune. Friend, foe, whoever, she'll walk over anyone if it gets her where she wants to go. Can't say that I personally condone it, but no deny that as both a competitor and a matchmaker, she's left a mark few superstars can equal. How does one contend with a superstar who is as ruthless in the ring as Sonya Deville? I think the only way to overcome Sonya's tenacity in the ring is to match it. You have to have that killer instinct when you're dealing with her. If you pull any punches, she'll run right over you. Handspring splash. Cover. And quick getting the arm up. Staying in this one. Ouch. Caught her. Oh, and look at the baseball slide. Whoa! Into the Hurricane Rana. She got her down. Is this it? And she's not done yet. She likely knew that wasn't enough. She's just keeping the pressure on. And Eo's offense gets fought off. Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. And what a maneuver we just saw there. DeVille struggling to defend herself. Unleashing that killer instinct, matching Sonya's tenacity. This is how you deal with DeVille. The Tetlip German suplex. Two count and still hanging on. She's still as determined as ever. Big form. Evades the attack. Oh my goodness, absolute dominance. You can sense what her intentions are here. Full Nelson prying open the arms and a great power escape and a shot to the back. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Every maneuver being returned with counter fire. Oh, and a reversal. Oh, 
And Sky stringing together some good offense. Io has everything going how she wants it. Oh, that backfired on her. These two showing how well scouted they each are. She saw it coming. Oh, both feet causing immense damage. She's showing signs of slowing now. A full display of ruthlessness from Io Sky there. Counter upon counter, great minds thinking alike. And face first, Brock Jack. Applying a rigorous stretch. DeVille struggling to defend herself. Uh oh. Dragon Sleeper. It's in. It's in tight. It's in deep. The Dragon Sleeper. You feel like hope is starting to fade away right Rolls through, and she's free. Hurricane Rana. Unbelievable athleticism. Sometimes you just got to show off and show out. Oh. From the top, sent off from the apron. Eo's capturing the momentum now. And I don't think anything can stop Eo now. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Countered with the knee to the face. Oh, catapulting down on the opponent. She covers for the pin. Pinfall there. Incredible. Good lord. Scarily close to three. Sky able to steer clear. Catches the leg. Flat out power here. A stalling butterfly back. Will it be? I think so. A kick out at two. What does she have to do to put her away? I'm asking myself the same question. I have no idea. Into a double knee drop. Cover! There's two! Kick out. She still has life. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Strong kick. My goodness. Big takedown right there. Shoulders down. This could be the one that does it for her. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. Big counter by Sky. Oh. We knew we were in for something special between these competitors, but they are taking things over their own limits. Butterfly backbreaker. Dodges out of the way. That's how you take an opponent down. Straight forearm. Sky might be looking to fly. And Eos taking flight. Moonsault connects. This is troublesome for Deville. Looking for the victory. Two. There it is. Eos Sky is your winner. Let's take another look at these ladies going toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Here is your winner, Io Sky! Io Sky celebrating tonight's win. This has to be a tough loss for DeVille, but I think she's going to use this as motivation for the future.
The following contest is a tag match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, accompanied by Santos Escobar, at a combined weight of 403 pounds, Humberto and Angel Garza. Legado del Fantasma. If you looked up tag team wrestling in the dictionary, these two would be the definition. Absolute masters at the tag team craft. And before we go any further, I'd like to extend a very Merry Christmas to our WWE Universe watching at home. Oh, I echo those sentiments, Michael. And I hope that Santa was good to everybody out there. Even you, Corey. I hope he brings you coal, Byron. Let's go. New Day Rocks. Michael, New Day Rocks. Corey? Shut up, Saxton. And their opponents at a combined weight of 417 pounds. Xavier Woods and Kofi Kingston. The New Day. You know, the only thing worse than this pancake and unicorn parade is that I know for a fact these guys are going to launch their clothes at me. <laughs> Don't be a negative Nancy, Corey. That's just part of the fun. It's not fun. And they need to fire whoever's doing their laundry. Oh, look out, Corey. Look out. The always vibrant and energetic New Day, ready to square off here. While they have fun, we've seen New Day have what it takes to win in big-time matches. Yeah, Michael, that doesn't mean you should let your guard down when facing the New Day, or you're likely to become vulnerable to their explosive and surprising offense. Actually, Byron, I'm surprised because that's true. There's no telling what new tricks the New Day has packed in their bag for this match. You can't argue their credentials, but don't overlook the team they're squaring off against. They've done their homework. They're coming into this fight as prepared as you can be. And that can be a difference maker, Corey. You can be a great team, but if your opponent has you scouted, you can become very vulnerable. Ooh. Oh, my God! Close line in the corner! Ooh. And Xavier Woods says it's time to turn up. Oh, and then the chest as well. Devastating elbow. Ooh, ah, oh, kick. Nasty kick. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. What the heck is this manager doing looking under the ring? He can't be acting like this. Ooh. He wasn't tough enough contending with one opponent. Now you got to deal with two. And that definitely made solid impact. Slam. And into the count. Two. Oh, he kicked out. He's still in the fight, but for how much longer? Basement drop kick. Kofi transmitting the power of positivity right about now. Lands the elbow. He knew that was coming. Oof. Oh, my God. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Counters with an attack on Umberto. Well, step up in, and he goes for the pin. Big kick out. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Ooh, stinging kick. 
Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. Followed up by a bulldog. In the cover. He narrowly avoids the count. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Partner tags in. Got the tag. Got the tag. Able to get the advantage here. Jeez. DDT plants them. Measured stomp right to the gut. Followed up by another to the chest. Catches the kick. Into a dragon screw leg whip. into the hip toss. I've seen Saxon thrown out of a few local bars like that before. Oh, please don't remind me, Corey. A handle applied. Up and... Oh, wow! Face first. Angel didn't exactly come up big against that one. Yeah, as New Day Ooh. building up that quicker pace there. With an arm roll and a clothesline! Climbing up top, he's got big play. Woods, top rope with the first limit break. Angel is in the worst way now for the win. And there's the save. Let's keep fighting. Hung out to dry. Humberto isn't being given any room to recover. Yeah, Humberto is on the wrong side of every exchange. Look at this. Target in the arm now. Steer clear of that. Going up top. Sky high. Oh, what a splash. That's got to be it. Two count. And he fights it off. Almost inhuman at this point. Umberto gets the better there. What's this gonna be? Wheelbarrow! Into a flapjack. Impressive. He's got the answer for that one. Bulldog! Tags him in. Tag is made, and he's coming in hot. A reversal catches you. Oh my! Able to interrupt the attack. Stops the kick. Now step up in Zagari. A <laughs> uh, timely counter by Umberto. Kick to the gut. Uh-oh. Blow to the abdomen gets them out of that. Victory Ray! Two and a half in the waning moments of this match. Bang! Drop kick. Oh. We are seeing these men leaving it all on the line. No stone being left unturned. Everything the body can give is being brought to the table. Kicks it. Wow, Kofi got all of it. Cover! Two! Three! No! Two count! I thought for sure this thing was wrapped up. Well, stay in your seat. Looks like we've got a ways to go yet. And Kobe's starting to become decisive. He's given everything tonight. He breaks the ref's count before two. If that won't beat him, I'm not sure anything will. Great evasion from Kobe. right into the bread basket. Xavier Woods tagged in. Oh, flying forearm. That'll turn your lights out. Placed into the corner. Kneecap goes right into the face to halt the attack. Boom! He is 
has just completely lost his wind. He can really stand to give back his look out. The dive! Took a massive risk, but it might have paid off. Tag made. Oh, I think something bad is about to happen to their opponent. Down they go. I'm not liking Umberto's odds here. Good, sweet, sweet victory. Here's another look at some of the previous action, giving their fans their money's worth and more. Kingston is the one to put this one away for the team. The New Day will get another reminder that the power of positivity conquers all. Hey, who's up for some pancakes? A true trailblazer when it comes to unorthodox style in the ring. Also, guys, I would say that competing on Christmas has to be a tremendous thrill. I can't speak for what it's like to be in the ring, but I can tell you it's an absolute blast to be here at ringside on such a special evening. This is going to be physical. Already a multiple time NXT champion looking to dominate all of NXT. The toughness of his father, the brash nature of his uncle. Braun definitely got all the good genes. And before I forget, allow me to wish everybody out there a very Merry Christmas. You know, I can't help but wonder what I did wrong to have to be spending Christmas sitting next to you two. Introducing the challenger from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, Rob Van Dam. And 
challenge his opponent from Woodstock, Georgia. Weighing in at 230 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Braun Breaker! The Intercontinental Championship, one of the most prestigious titles in all of sports entertainment. So much history attached to the Intercontinental Championship. So much weight attached to this match. Yeah, but right now it's all about living in the present, in the now. That's the only way the champ's gonna get out of this with his title and toe. Launched into a German suplex. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Right to the face. My God. Big forearm. This is just brute power. Release German. He's returning fire. Set up in the corner of the ring. Caught him right in the jaw. Ugh, what a shot. Overhead, belly to belly. Corey, at the risk of sounding indelicate, how do you deal with a genetic freak like Braun Breaker? He is indeed a genetic freak, but Braun Breaker is also very young. Braun's natural talent. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Kick out close to three. This could be a tipping point in this match. Ooh. Now watch the precision with this. What a blow. Carefully measured right. This is an unwieldy attack from Braun. Tough spot for Van Damme. To the stomach. Cross the shoulders up and gut check. Covered by the champ. No, he pops the shoulder before three. You have to think this battle is starting to weigh down on him. Hey, you can't do that. There was no issue with that attack. Hey, sometimes desperate times call for desperate measures. Who are we to judge? He's able to fend off the attack. Reversal from Braun. Able to sidestep it. A counter answered by another counter. Oh, was that a spear? And for the title. Kick out and the title fight continues. How in the world did he kick out? Breaker sidesteps out of that. On the top of the world, sidewalk slam. Five. Breaker's fired up and wants this crowd to know. Nicely done. Looking for the victory. There's two. No, he gets the shoulder up. Obviously still has some fight left. Strikes with a kick. He saw that one coming. Turning the tables there. An agile escape. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. Ooh, clothesline delivered. Look what that did to RVD's face. Oh! Standing moonsault gets all of it. Two fights out at two. How? How? RVD keeps him at bay. Great job refocusing to reverse that. Boom! Catches the kick. Spectacular counter into a dragon screw. Oh, that might have just broken something. And that holds RVD back. Round we go and into the side slam. Nice. To retain the title. Retains. No. Challenger kicks out. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. He... RBD bringing down his opponent with a series of close lines. Sliding out of the way, followed by a kick. Oh. 
RVD off the rope. Uh-oh. Knees up. Saw it coming and was laying in wait. Nice hip toss takedown. Oh, great athleticism and a drop kick to finish. The champ getting put to the test here. Yeah, RVD with a very efficient form of offense. For the middle rope. Bulldog. Now a pin for the championship. No, championship match continues. How does anyone kick out at this point? Boom. Ooh, short kick. Out of the way in time. Ron avoids the attack. He avoids the damage. Look at this incredible power. The Gorilla Press. Wow. Beautiful moonsault. <laughs> wow. Did that just happen? Two count. Emphatic kick out from the champion. He just won't give up. Connects the fist to the face. Great counter. Suplex. He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of moments. Just tremendous raw power from Braun Breaker. The military press into the power slam. The champ will stay champ. And he's still in the game. And look at the disbelief on the face of the champion. They both know what's at stake. Neither competitor is going to lose easy here. We're about to learn a lot about this kid, Braun Breaker, guys. How will he respond to such a close near fall? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Trader pile driver, my goodness! The champ's eyes look glazed over. Oh, the champ avoids a three count. That was a matter of a fraction of a second. And Rob's not one to get too frustrated, but you have to think the sense of urgency is starting to kick in. Every person in this capacity crowd is on their feet. And with good reason. These superstars are earning all of their respect. Stone! A championship level move. Braun Breaker has his spear. The title's going nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Good night. Cover! Wow, there it is. And Braun Breaker keeps the title around his waist. No doubt it was a good one. Here's another look. Good job by our champion holding on to that title. He just cemented his title reign with a gutsy performance. He's a tag match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 409 pounds, Ashante the Adonis and Cedric Alexander, the Brotherhood. This is a top-level team, guys. Each of these superstars could be a main eventer by themselves, but together, they're even better.
And guys, I hope Santa was good to you this morning. Oh, he's always good to me, Cole. Though, I'm pretty sure Saxton ended up with Cole in his stocking. Chase U is here. We're all about to get a lesson. And their opponents, accompanied by Thea Hale, at a combined weight of 469 pounds, Andre Chase and Duke Hudson. Chase U. Everybody's hoping to be on the Dean's list after tonight. Or else they'll be put on double secret probation. Also, guys, I would say that competing on Christmas has to be a tremendous thrill. I can't speak for what it's like to be in the ring, but I can tell you it's an absolute blast to be here at ringside on such a special evening. Class is in session for Chase U, and tonight their opponents have some tough lessons in store. You can certainly learn a lot watching Andre Chase and Duke Hudson at work. As long as they avoid the... Oh, my forearm caught him! He got whipped into that corner. Andre wards that attack off. The jumping complete shot. Face first. Oh, what are they going to do here? Set up in position. With leg moonsault. Tag is good. Here's a tag. Setting up for something. Oh, my. Great tandem offense. Those two are in such a cohesive rhythm out there. It's like playing jazz, but using your opponent as the drum. Able to capitalize on Chase's mistake. Oh, my Lord. Ashanti the Adonis is fired up and wants this crowd to know it. Able to get there in time. And oh my, my god, what a forearm! That's a jaw. Across the top rope, what a hot shot. Going for a power slam, slips down from behind into an inverted DDT. A stalemate of counters. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Oh, man. Shot right to the midsection. And Duke's focus got a bit shaken there. The competitor in Adonis coming through here. He's going for it all. Look at the height. Moved out of the way. Nobody home. Counter. And now. Stops the incoming attack with a knee to the face. Oh, oh. Boom. Oh, what a kick. Oof. And Duke with the evasion. Dodges. He must have had that scouted. Cuts off their offense with a swift elbow to the gut. What an uppercut. That'll cost some teeth. This could do it. No shoulders up at two. Wow. Oh, oh man, a little extra luster behind that kick. Oh man. 
He's going to try to put him away once and for all. He's out there in no man's land. Suicide dive. Like a heat-seeking missile hit the target right on the mark. And gets tossed back into the mat. And he's in now. Finally. Oh, ouch. Elbow throw saying not today. Nice drop kick. Andre is unable to stop this string of offense. Yeah, now Chase has got to turn the momentum around. Jumping neck breaker. Ouch. He went right into that turnbuckle. Got the legs. He's in a little bit of trouble now. This is when you have to take advantage of tag team rules and get yourself some breathing room. No good reason to stay in this right now. Osrata kicked all the way to the floor. Cedric looking to end this. Picked up and driven down into a brain buster. Here's a cover. Could be it. Got it. No, oh, just a two. And you got to think he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Oh, what a close line. Forcefully delivered. Counter by Ashante. Chase able to avert that. He gets out of the way. Caught with the Larian. Oh, devastating kick. Charring European uppercut. He's expressing pain now. There is no way this can go on for much longer. For the win. There's two. No, stops the count at two. Now is not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Shanti's skill is on display. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Oh, a flurry of strikes. Able to capitalize on Chase's mistake. Put it in the corner. Tag is made. This duo looking to make something big happen here, but just how big remains to be seen. Blockbuster! Is it enough to put Chase away? Cover! Two! And the victory! These guys feel no love for each other. Here's another look. with these two superstars. Look, Chase, you might be down for right now, but I think we all know not to count them out.
the consummate underdog of the women's division, Zelina Vega. Zelina has seen a tremendous amount of success lately. She won the Queen's crown and reformed the LWO. And Zelina's not showing any signs of slowing down. Zelina was no stranger to success before, but now she seems destined for the top. The epitome of destruction, a wrecking ball in the women's division. Nia Jax has targeted everyone in the women's locker room. Whether it be as a singles or tag team competitor, Jax has dominated and reached the very top. Indeed, Nia Jax has become an unrelenting, remorseless powerhouse. Introducing the challenger from Queens, New York, Zelina Vega! And her opponent from San Diego, California, the WWE Women's World Champion, Nia Jax! The referee letting our competitors take one final look at what this match will be all about. The decorated Women's World Championship. All eyes are on this match for the Women's World Championship. With this kind of prize on the line, you just know this will be a knockdown, drag out fight. I'd expect nothing less. These women are convinced that this is their moment, their time, that this title is theirs for the taking. Oh, drops the hammer right on the lower back. Oh my God, a close line! Nia avoids contact. Nia Jax so powerful, but one could easily argue that what she has in power and strength, she lacks in speed and agility. Would you agree, Corey? I would, Cole, and I would even say that that's key to creating an even playing field. Don't try to overpower the powerhouse. Instead, focus on picking up and dictating the pace, making Nia work for it, and ultimately tiring out the irresistible force. The springboard attack fails to land. Landed face first. Elbow drop. And Nia is revving this crowd up. Running Hurricane Rana. Fantastic. Showing off the quickness. That'll turn things around in a hurry. The challenger's looking shaken. Jax might have just made a big opportunity for herself. Turnbuckle's the only thing keeping her upright. And Nia is revving this crowd up. To the stomach. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, gross. I think I'm going to be sick. Flying. Nobody home for that one. Oh, goodness. What a moonsault. Oh, new champ. New champ, no! If she keeps the pressure on, the next one might do it. Ooh, 
sidewalk slam. Off into the pin. Two. And she kicks out at two. You have to think this match is starting to take its toll. Ooh, dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. Quick exchange of counters there. Wait for it. Boom! Alabama slam. The challenger not looking good right now. They've definitely taken their lumps at this point. Their opponent is not messing around. Down in a hurry. Up on their shoulders. Simone drop. Take off. Leg drop from the ropes. Kicks out. This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. She's able to get out of the way. Picking up speed, building. Oof, and that's not the result she was looking for. And Nia is revving this crowd up. Big form. Looking wobbly in the corner. What a counter! And both athletes showing that they have each other's number. Ah, fireman's carry! And a front slam to follow! Cover! Two! Ah, oh, it's still... To no! Title still on the line! That's really as close as it gets. Oh, man! And Zelina finding herself on the defensive. This is exactly why Jax is so dominant. Drop kick right to the knee. And Jax got taken to task right there. And that's the kind of ability Vega's looking to show tonight. She's got an answer for that. Boom! <laughs> Strong Irish whip. And Nia is revving this crowd up. But can it be capitalized on? Boom! What a forearm! Ooh, walloped by a huge club. And it's a long way down from there. <laughs> Nia Jax beating down her opponent. Looks like she's gonna climb. I do not like the looks of this, Michael. Nia Jax from the middle rope has her opponent Jacks with a Samoan drop. That's gotta be it. There's two. Oh my god, that was so close. And you believe it? Can you believe she powered out? Wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. How in the world can you get knocked? Submission hold. She does break out of it, but has the damage been done? <laughs> Turn Nia Jax around there. Right on the patella. Oh, costly error there. Ooh. Zelina escapes. The oh, look at this. And it proved to be with a telegraph. And she's seen that sequence before. She knew exactly what was coming. And we just saw some serious offense. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Strong kick out at two from the champion. She just won't stay down. Big down one. Shoulders down. We almost had a new champion. Guys, I thought we were getting a new champion there. <laughs> what? We might see a new champ here tonight. Don't put the cart before the horse. The champ kicked out and has no intentions on losing that title anytime soon. You got to give a lot of credit here. <laughs> a thunderous headbutt by Jax. And things are about to go from bad to worse for Nia's opponent.
in position, making the climb. Here it comes, Annihilator. Looks like the champ is going to retain. With that, Nia Jax continues her reign. Let's look back on the action from the last match. She just proved you come for the champ, you best not miss. A group to be feared, the Judgment Day. Yeah, a ruthless, cutthroat collective. The Judgment Day have become a well-oiled machine of brutality. The Judgment Day can beat you in so many ways. The numbers gain, brute force, or pure intimidation. Yeah, basically, they become of one mind, a singular focus of dominance. A win for one is a win for all, and they all will win tonight. Also, guys, I would say that competing on Christmas has to be a tremendous thrill. I can't speak for what it's like to be in the ring, but I can tell you it's an absolute blast to be here at ringside on such a special evening. Huge title defense for the champs coming up next, guys. It's definitely a big match for him, Cole, but given how they've looked of late, I suspect they'll walk out of here the same way they walked in, as champs. Obtaining those tag team championships, being on the same page will be vital in this one.
Here we go with the Judgment Day in the ring. This group causes chaos and destruction wherever they go, all in the pursuit of amassing as much power as they can. Judgment Day is a legitimate threat to anyone in WWE. They have the numbers, the talent, and they will smash any superstar in their way. Yeah, Judgment Day won't rest. The champion's down, the champion's down. Oh my God, we're gonna have a new champion. It's not over yet, plenty left to go in this one. Lined him up. Oh, and a forearm. Super kick! And Nathan got bottled up there. Nathan retaliates. Going counter for counter. Now, can it be capitalized on? Getting him into the corner. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Laying across the top turnbuckle, certainly not ideal. All right, shot to the lower back. And that's just the beginning. Avalanche, Sherman Soup. Going for a pin for the championship. Power right out and one. Strong kick out, but you have to wonder if he can keep it up. Tag made, tag made. A defensive elbow to the gut ends that. Vicious right forearm. Ooh, vicious headbutt. Oh, brain buster. High impact offense like that is exactly what you want to do in a title fight. Oh, are you kidding me? Back of his neck. The shoulder up before two. It'll take more than that to hold him down. Short clothesline hits its mark. And JD's keeping the pressure on. Axiom now just trying to survive. Oh, she's removing the turnbuckle pad. Come on, this isn't right. And Zagiri finds its mark. All the way up for a suplex. No, 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 no. Wiggles free. Into a chop block. Big forearm. Here's the headbutt. What a double knee strike. And off the tag is Finn Balor. Ooh. Trying their opponent's arm out. There's a double stop right down on the arm. It did not look like Axiom had a solution for that problem. Balor really sent a message there. Blast off. Tiny front drop kick. Here's the pin. Before two. Getting that shoulder up seemed to be pretty easy. Big knee to the midsection. Boom! Boom! Saw it coming. He was elusive there. What a forearm. Left by the turnbuckles. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. And misses on the springboard. Hoist it up and down, 19-16. Looking for a little bit of high risk here, it seems. Ben Balor up top. We can have a new champion. That's got to be it. Two coming to the rescue. Caught square by the haymaker. Takedown, crushing double stop. Able to reverse that one. Ooh. Oh, he knew what was coming. Axiom sensed that was coming. He has him in his grasp. Saw it coming and got out of there. Oh, Fujiwara armbar applied. Here he comes off the tag. He moves just in time. Big knee to the mid. 
midsection. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. And Balor is firing up the crowd here. He's been placed in the corner now. Oh, no offense. Oh, a deafening blow to the chest. The effects of this match are showing that this superstar is obviously trying to end this in a big way. Why wait? Let's do it now. There's no getting up from this. Oh, my gosh. From the top. Butterfly suplex. Finn Balor to the top rope. This is where Finn Balor is at home. And here's another quick look at those superstars in action in that tag team battle. Here are your winners and the new World Tag Team Champions, Finn Balor. making their case for one of the best teams around with that win. For my money, these two just might be the best tag team on the roster today. Here comes the 330 pounder, Bronson Reed. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Black Forest, South Australia, weighing in at 330 pounds, Bronson Reed. The kaiju of WWE, Big Bronson Reed. He has been on an absolute tear as of late. We've seen him beat some big names, compete in some major matches. I think it's just a matter of time before Bronson really hits it big. Gentlemen, big Bronson Reed is ready to claw through the competition. And I don't think anyone can stop him. Here comes trouble, straight from the island of Samoa. And his opponent from the Isle of Samoa, weighing in at 350 pounds, the Samoan Bulldozer, Umaga! We may be about to see a fight or a one-sided mauling. Umaga went undefeated in WWE for over a half a year. Yeah, during that time, Umaga earned victories over the likes of Kane, John Cena, Shawn Michaels, and Triple H. Unmatched savagery inside the ring from bell to bell from Umaga. And guys, I hope Santa was good to you this morning. Oh, he's always good to me, Cole. Though, I'm pretty sure Saxton ended up with Cole in his stocking. He's one of the most purely destructive superstars we've ever seen, Umaga. He can't be reined in or stopped. Umaga pursues victory with as of yet unmatched aggression and brutality. And that's what they call him, the Samoan bulldozer, Cole. The ferocity Umaga exhibits inside the ring is enough to knock down a building. So if you find yourself on the wrong side of Umaga, good luck to you. But it's going to take much more than just luck to survive an encounter with him. But then we've got Big Bronson Reed, a bully in the ring who could just plow through any opposition foolish enough to get in his way. When Bronson Reed sets his sights on you, just about all you can do is brace for impact. 
and there is no mercy to be found. There's no feeling out process, no interest in trading blows. Reed just wants to get his hands on you and flatten you as quickly as possible. We've seen how damaging pile drivers can be, and that one looked particularly painful. Mistake by Umaga. Oh, look at this. What a headbutt. What's going to be the key for Umaga tonight if he wants to completely dominate his opponent? Umaga needs to be as deliberate as he is destructive. If he can control the pace, it'll be a very difficult night for his opponent. Whoa! Oh! Suicide dive! Pinpoint precision right on target. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Put it in a position now. Check your face out of that one. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. That's you in your head. He reverses it. Channeling his energy to stay in this matchup. Double axe handle. Oh, just scrubbing the face on the canvas. And an elbow drop for added measure. Big forearm. Flattened with a body block. Followed immediately by a big elbow. Opportunity. And Reed fends that off. Elbow drop. Momentum is running away from Umaga. Reed's a wrecking ball in motion. And shoulders are down. Only a one count before the kick out. Not even a near fall there. Oh, ouch. Oh, look at the well placed elbow right on the mark. Gloating and put your attention back to the match. Showing off their deadlifting prowess and just tossing them aside. It might not be flashy, but sometimes you just gotta toss another person to make a statement. No way! Oh, just completely off target there. Tempted fate and paid dearly for it. That haphazard approach definitely proved costly. Uh-oh. Look at this. He just tossed the leg. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. And Umaga is all business now. This will do it. Umaga, solo in spike. Umaga can be looking to end this. What, only two? I don't know how he did it, but he's hanging in there. Just how much pain is he willing to endure in this match? And I think we all know this is only going to make a monster like Umaga even angrier. Absolutely crushing display of power from the big Aussie. And proving a bit slippery for them there. Defenses are sharp in this series of reversals. Umaga is really out of it. He might be done soon. Oh, across the shoulders into a sit-out axe driver. And Umaga's laid out. He, no way, no way. There is not a more. 
more terrifying sight than Umaga kicking out after you hit him with your best shot. And it may just take going to the well one more time with that maneuver to gain the pinfall. And Reed capitalizes there. Flying forearm connects. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Look at these debilitating forearm strikes. Ooh, just relentless. And Reed is taking command of this one. Umaga has to find a way to turn things around. Vicious right forearm. He turns it around on Umaga. Whoa! Using their body as an absolute weapon. We continue to see incredible perseverance from these competitors. The war continues to rage on with no superstar willing to give an inch. Now Umaga looking for some momentum. Umaga showing he can't be trifled with for too long. He turns it around. Military cross. I don't know if Omaga can withstand much more of this. Bronson Reed incessant in his approach. Oh, man. Into a dragon screw leg whip. Great counter impressive ring IQ on display there. Uh oh. Cross the shoulders. Airway crash neck breaker. Off the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? Oh, no, no! Can Reed close it out? Two. They have every right to be happy about the victory in this match. Hard fought as they come. Huge win. Yeah, there were some moments there where I wasn't. Oh, hold uh -oh, on a second. Hang on. Oh, you can cut the tension in here with a knife. Solo Sokoa is here with nothing but bad intentions. The following contest is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring, representing the bloodline from Las Vegas, Nevada. Weighing in at 250 pounds, Solo Sokoa! Solo is a man who annihilates the competition with ruthless and unflinching efficiency. We've learned that the enforcer of the bloodline is not about talking. He is all action. And before we go any further, I'd like to extend a very Merry Christmas to our WWE Universe watching at home. Uh, I echo those sentiments, Michael. And I hope that Santa was good to everybody out there. Even you, Corey. I hope he brings you coal, Byron. Phenomenal, he really is. Still performing at such a high level after over 25 years of competing. Yeah, Cole, at this point, AJ's forgotten more about this business than most will ever know. And before we go any further, I'd like to extend a very Merry Christmas to our WWE Universe watching at home. Uh, I echo those sentiments, Michael. And I hope that Santa was good to everybody out there. Even you, Corey. I hope he brings you coal, Byron.
from the underground of New York City, Damian Priest has arrived. Calm demeanor, but about to unleash chaos. And from New York City, weighing in at 249 pounds, Damian Priest. Damian Priest is the genuine article, living the best rock star life, champagne, jacuzzis, beautiful ladies on each arm. This dude is the real deal. And all business in the ring. Born and raised in the concrete jungle of New York City, Damian Priest lives to throw hands. Damian Priest has this unchecked rage, ready to attack at will. He'll shut you down, and in the end, he will turn out your lights. A triple threat match underway with the opening bell. One more superstar to account for. One more eye to have in the back of your head. Any strategy you might have had going into this match, it's time to throw it out the window. And shoulders are down. And the referee stops the count before two. Getting the shoulder up before two tells me the end is not near. Nice right, suplex. Incoming, headbutt to the gut! And it seems like you have to be at least a little sadistic to be victorious in an ODQ match. Oh, come on. Well, it's not about being sadistic, it's about being smart. There's no safety net in a no disqualification match, and that's a big factor in succeeding. There's nothing sadistic about it. Tossed into the corner. Acrobatics like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Reverses the move into a DDT. Suplex attempt. Able to go behind, though. From behind, chop block. Oh, weakening the leg here. Debilitating attacks like that are exactly how you create a big opening. And there is no other term for that than just cheap, a cheap shot. The Irish curse. Oh, the reversal by Priest. Power slam. And that one misses the mark. Big forearm. Good God, he missed mark. Boom. And Jacoa's bad mood could only turn worse after that. Dragon screw. Sure, he's pumping himself up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. Oh, my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. Target the... He can do it here. Oh, my. How in the world did he kick out of that? Still in it. Oh, and a four -arm. Lives to fight another day. Oh, 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 what a Samoan drop. Off into the pin. There's two. Just kicks out. At this point in the match, that could have gone either way. Kicking out there really has to make his opponent question his game plan. Good timing with that reversal. Big overhand. Oof. Lands the haymaker. Set up for the side Russian leg sweep. Vicious right forearm. Priest wants to finish this one. This will do it. Broken arrow. Oh, great. Now for something painful and tough. Oh. Damian Priest. Rip locked in on a tour south of heaven. That's going to keep Sokoa down. Two. He's still in this fight. 
Oh, I thought that was game over. Pure guts to kick out there. That was close, but Damian Priest doesn't look like he's letting that distract him from the task at hand. Oh, saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Big back body drop. Oh, you see the height on that? Priest dodges out of that. He skirts around it. Oh, gosh. Priest with the elevated flatliner. Ooh. And he sends him into the corner. Damien Priest. Crucifix. Crucifix power bomb. Priest ended this fight. He's going for the pen. This could be it. Oh. Forces the shoulder up after two. This is going to come down to who wants it more. The need is being torn apart now. That's gonna hurt. The end may be in sight for his opponent here. Yeah, not looking good at all. He's got a table. We know where this is going, gentlemen. By the throat into the top rope. Oof. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. Here we go. Risky. We got a cover. He breaks the rest count after one. Unbelievable display of will in the late stages. Does he have it here? Oh, somehow managed to keep this match going. Holy moly, how? Splash. I'll tell you this, guys, no competitor here is looking to give in. It's going to take a lot to end this fight. We are just seeing sheer perseverance. Nothing is being left back. Oh, that light tube just shattering all over them. Ooh, that got turned around on Styles. So precise with the super kick. Damian Priest has got him set up for the broken air. <laughs> Snapmare takedown. Ooh. Oh my goodness. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a yard sale. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. And set right into the corner. Oh, flipping the script on him there. Comes back into the ring. AJ Styles. Set him up. Styles clash. Damien doesn't know where he is. Two. Hangs on by a thread. Damien Priest rising from the brink with a hell of a kick out. And you have to think that doubt is coming into the mind of Styles at this point. Good night. Sure. That turns it around for Solo. Sokoa is focused on finishing this. Vicious right forearm. Winding up. Boom! Samoa spike. That's one for Sokoa before. He kicks out somehow. You do not get a moniker like the phenomenal one if you just lay down and go out easily. What perseverance from Styles. That was plan A, and it didn't work. He must be thinking about plan B at this point. And this has quickly become a match to be remembered. A classic in the making. How in the world is it going to end? Not where you want to be right now. Boom. Or the table just blew it. That was painful 
just to watch. Everybody. And just like that, lift off, sent off from the apron. Hoist it up. Burning hammer. Whip back into the ring. Does he get him here? No, I thought he had it. You gotta be kidding me. Thought he had it. You gotta be kidding me. Bam. Dodged right on cue. These two having an answer for everything. <laughs> what impact. We're going to take a trip south of heaven. Is that enough for Priest? We're going to be hard-pressed to see a better match than that. Here's another look. Here is your winner, Damian Priest! That's your winner, folks, outlasting all other superstars in this match. Triple threat matches tend to live up to the hype, and this one was no different, you guys. This is an extraordinary sight. Goose bump inducing. The awe inspiring entrance of The Undertaker. Darkness has completely engulfed this entire building. Admit it, Byron, you're scared. A little bit. We are seeing a legend in the flesh. Long, harrowing walk to the ring by the Phenom. The personification of evil. Such an ominous and chilling aura. When the Undertaker comes to town. This is always his stage. It's always his yard. And if you're his opponent, you know the end is near. And guys, I hope Santa was good to you this morning. Oh, he's always good to me, Cole. Though I'm pretty sure Saxton ended up with Cole in his stocking. General has arrived. A man who ruled NXT with an iron fist and now looks to dominate the main roster. Yeah, yeah. 
Cutter's all business. There is very little wasted motion in this man when he gets going. Well, there may be roadblocks in his path, but Gunther's dominance has shown no signs of slowing. Record-breaking reigns with the NXT UK and Intercontinental titles. He's put away main eventers and future Hall of Famers while defending those titles. Introducing the challenger from Death Valley. Weighing in at 309 pounds. The Undertaker! And his opponent from Vienna, Austria. Just look at all the gold on the World Heavyweight title. A glorious looking championship. The envy of all men who don't possess it. The World Heavyweight Championship is up for grabs in this matchup. Who will end tonight as the champion? Who will come out on top? And that was an effective attack, guys. Undertaker DDT. He steers clear of contact. Knew what was coming from Taker. Drop kick. Oh, oh great height. Turn fire with the headbutt. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Nasty elbow shots trying to create separation. The Undertaker has been on top of this industry for decades now. He's won every prize WWE has to offer and has been the dominant force of this company. All true, Cole, but he still wants to prove that he's still got it. And he's prepared to do that at his opponent's expense, putting all of his years of in-ring success to work. Boy, overhand chop! Good grief! That's a chop that'll wake you up. Kick. Uncorks a thunderous chop. Great awareness by the dead man. Big hook. Denied via a wicked punch to the stomach. Foot overhand chop. The vicious Gunther building up that energy. Things are not going to be pretty. Hits him with the counter. Placing them into the corner. Wicked clothesline. And Gunther is really playing it up for the WWE Universe. <laughs> Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Undertaker retaliates. Pushing their opponent up, draped over the top rope. And this is just unmatched brutality. Don't do it! Look out below! Just a devil-may-care attitude on full display. Going for broke, and it pays off. Ooh! The challenger being outclassed here. 
This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Undertaker's clearly looking for a fight here. Ooh. Able to elude it. Uh-oh. Thunderous powerbomb. Just a ruthless maneuver from the ring general. True old school power on this with a championship on the line. Kicks out. He still has life. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Just mocking their opponent right now. Total disrespect. And Gunther is showboating right now. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. He moved, but can he capitalize? Tough position to be caught in here. And he gets out of trouble by fighting out of that one. And Guther is shook. The ring general showing off his power. Delivering a power bomb. I think the, the chance got it. Somehow he kicked out. Simply refusing to let this opportunity slip away. And who knows if there'll be another shot, yet you can't give up now. And Guther definitely thought that would put him down. I can't imagine he's going to take it easy on him after such a defiant kick out. Well-scattered reversal there. Undertaker saw it coming. The dead man. Into the last ride. Cover. Two. Breaks the close count. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. The dead man lining up his next victim moments away. The Undertaker scoops him up. Tombstone. Gonna see a new champ. Cover. What a kick out. I don't believe it. This is complete insanity. Still holding on to the title by the skin of their teeth. I think The Undertaker might be happy about that kick out. He has dished out a beating, and it looks like it's not. Gunther with his opponent all the way up. A power bomb. The champ has this one in hand now. Heading up, he's thinking big. Incoming. Diving from the top. Cover. There's two. No, didn't get it. The determination of the challenger keeps this match going. You can just see how much this title means, how much one is willing to go to to claim themselves as the new champion. He catches Guther with a big counter. Well-placed elbow to break up the maneuver. Knife edge chop! Anything can happen in WWE, and this audience is seeing that firsthand. The entire WWE Universe is going to have to pick your jaws off the floor after this one's done. Ooh. Painful attack focused on the chest. Undertaker isn't being given any room to recover. And I don't see Gunther slowing down whatsoever. Knife edge chop. Kick lands. Ooh. Knee drop connects. Unusual showmanship from Guther here. Ooh, man. Oh, yeah. Let's just all take a moment to truly appreciate and embrace his presence. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Larry.
Saw that coming. He switches it back around. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Uh-oh. Thunderous powerbomb. Undertaker's lost all power. The dead man is looking beatable. The ring general powerbomb. Another one bites the dust to the champ. Try as you might, you just can't get the title off. Gunther. And here's a look back at some of the action from the previous match. successful title defense for him tonight. What a title defense for him tonight. He came in with that unshakable champion mentality.